Hello, Peter Mel here at the Quicksilver Pro France 2013. I'm here to show you how a surfboard is made at Euroglass. This is home of the Quicksilver surfboards. Come check it out. Now we're inside the factory, and as you can see, Stephen Bell, the owner of Euroglass, has done an amazing job collecting all of Kelly Slater's jerseys. These are all of his wins owed to Kelly Slater. We'll head upstairs and check out where these blanks are made. This is the start of the tour. So here we are, the first stop. This is what we call a blank. This is the raw materials, a polyurethane. We're gonna take this thing over here into a shaping machine, which is where we start to see the custom work being done. This is a computer that actually shapes these boards. They take everyone's custom files and they bring them into this machine. This machine cuts it and cuts it out, smooths it out. After it comes out of the computer, it goes into this room and this is where the human adds the magic. As you can see, Mark Phipps here is working on his boards now. When you're working with a team rider like Jeremy that we work with consistently, you can get really down to really fine details in a board, you know, like within millimetres, just altering bits and pieces, thicker, thinner rails, different rockers, and you know, just really fine tuning the board. So here we are in the colour room. This is where we take that freshly shaped blank. We take these water-based colours, the airbrush here. This is where the artist could put his little magic touches on it and colour it all beautiful. After it's done coloured, we take it downstairs to the glassing room, and that's where we glass it up into the glassing room where we actually put the hard shell onto the surfboards. After we've come from the color room or the shaping room, depending on how they've done it, we'll put it down in this room and what we do is we add this fiberglass cloth. We lay it onto the surfboard and then they use a glue, which is a polyurethane resin, and they'll add it to the top and they catalyze it with catalyst. At this point, we can go over to the fin systems once it's dried. We'll add the fin systems, which you can do FCS, Futures, whatever fin systems they require. Then we'll do a process called a hot coat, and we'll actually add wax to the resin, and they'll fill it. So on to the last process. This is the sanding process. Behind me, you see these are boards that have been uh, pulled out of the glassing shop. Nice and hard, already so solid. Still some raw edges on it that need to be smoothed out. That's what Paul is doing behind me. What they've done now is he'll take finer or sandpaper, raw sandpaper, and make it finer and finer and finer. It makes it nice and smooth. And then at that point, they'll add just a, a bit of a wipe on finish and it's ready to hit the water. Thanks for joining me on the tour here of Euroglass. I'm gonna grab my new board. Thanks to the folks here at Quicksilver Surfboards. So uh, what do I owe you for this one? I was saying you the bill on the pipe, right? What? What, what huh? Bill? Yeah. Oh, I'm out of here. See you guys. And it's cut.